welcome back to my channel and I hope you're doing well. Hello if you're new here, thank you for clicking on this video. Today I wanted to show you a bit of a room transformation. I redone up my room, I painted it all by myself and I went and got some new bits for it. So it's really like serene and white and here's a sneak peek. Um, yeah, so I wanted to show you um, what I did to it. Mainly some things are from like the range, B&M, you know, those kind of shops. So they're super easy to buy if you're interested in getting any of them. So I hope you enjoy the video. Let's just jump on into it and see my DIY skills and my handiwork. Uh, yeah, let's go. Okay, so this back wall here is just all grey. It needs all done here. But I'm just going to paint it white. I've painted this wall white and this wall white. So this one here is going to be white soon. So this is one coat. I need to get ladders and get up there. But this is one coat of the white. This one's drying in really well. So this is a paint I got. I got it from Home Base. It's called Craig and Ross Glitter Glaze Starlight Silver. So I'll show you on the inside. So I did just open it up. So it looks like this. And this is going to give it a top coat, I hope, of silver. So this is the table when it's had two coats of the white paint. There is a bit here that's still the wood, but I'm going to paint over it with the silver. So it just looks like this so far. But I'm going to do the silver top and then put the glass on. this is it when the first coat of the glittery paints on like look at this amazing it says leave it for four hours to dry so I'm gonna leave it I did the top of it and then I've also did the legs so you can see the legs are glittery as well so this is my DIY desk I did put the glitter paint underneath can you see it better now I'm absolutely obsessed with it so it looks like this and then you get the reflections of the lights. So pretty. Hi everyone, so I just wanted to show you a quick overview of my room before I get into the details. So I really love what I've done with this space. Um, it actually smells amazing in here. I have a little essential oil burning. So this is a quick overview of my room. I love my lights and everything, but we'll just start over here. So I have this area here, which is like a desk, but it's more of like a coffee table stand. Um, and I just have random bits on it. So I have this little jewelry box here. I also have this little essential oils burner, which I got from Home Bargains, as well as the mat as well. And it has all these nice oils and quotes I then made this quote wall so this is just a cork board which I have pinned on different quotes and I love that and then with my window I kept it really bare I just have these gray curtains with these nice sweet tie backs these were actually in the wedding section I think it was in like B&M or Home Bargains and it was in the wedding section so I just used them as tie backs which I thought was pretty cool and then over to my favorite area so this is my desk which I will insert the footage of me making this desk so this is from Ikea but it actually used to be brown so I painted it white and then I also painted on it like glittery flecks if you can see um, I'll show you better in the other clip so yeah, this is my desk area where I like to do my work and film my videos. So this photo here is a new one. I picked it up from B&M. 
So you can see the sparkles on it. I love it. It's just like an off-white color. So with this rim, the walls, this wall used to be gray and this wall was like cream, but I painted it all white. So then with my desk, you can see I have loads of like cute little bits. So this one is from Asda. It's like a floating tea light. This one here is from b and I think. It's an H and then an Aries because that's my star sign. Then over here, I have this little flickering one that's a battery operated candle. And then this one here, I think it's from b and uh, It was just recently bought that one. This here, so this vase was from b and but I actually cut the flowers down and made it myself. And then this candle here is gorgeous. I think this one is from Asda as well, but it looked very Chanel, so I was obsessed. And this little card holder here is from Next. So then this is my mirror, and this mirror is from B&M. It's gorgeous, it just balances on my desk, and I have a pink cushion. So moving over to my bed area. So these bedding is from Asda, and they're reversible. So you can have the pink or you can have the gray side. And I just love these lights behind it. They go on different settings as well. So like at night time, I'll have it with like the flickering lights and it's so cute. And then over here, the, um, this is still a work in progress. So here I'm gonna get three frames and I wanna put up either like fashion prints or quotes because I just think they're really nice. I wanna do like thin black frames or thin just white frames with three prints. So I will show you whenever it's complete, but my room's not complete yet, but I just wanted to show you what I've done so far. This plant here is beautiful. So I got this one when I was at the range and it has pink feathers on it and it comes in a gray like pot, you can call. So yeah, I love this. This was 20 pound from the range, but I think the added bit of pink here just really ties in nicely with the bedding which my sister got me for my birthday, I think, or my graduation, and she bought me a star, so, so cute. And then finally over here, I just have this fluffy rug with my slippers. Um, this rug was from B&M, and yeah, I love it. So it's really simple and minimalistic. I didn't wanna to have too much clutter in my room. This lampshade is from The Range. And yeah, as I said, it smells amazing because I love having candles and essential oils on. And I'll try and show you a picture or a video of it at night time. And you can get a better feel of the lights. So yeah, I hope you enjoy. And like I say, I'll show you when it's all finished. So these are my lights at night. How cute are they? So thank you guys so, so much for sticking around and watching this video. Please comment down below what you think of my room, any bits that you think I should add. I really wanna get some prints for this wall. So if you do have good like website recommendations, just leave them in the comments below. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.